Hi and welcome to Tags Direct. This video is an introduction to our tear-proof and waterproof tags and answers to the most frequently asked questions we get asked through the website. So what's the standard size? We get asked, asked that all the time. Um, we can do any size really. The sizes we suggest that are on this product page are merely the most popular ordered by our customers. Um, so how tear-proof and waterproof are they? Well in terms of waterproof there's only one way to really find out. So these are our tear-proof ones. Um, as you can see actually here, there's different sizes. These are just random ones that we've got. So I've got a bowl of water here. We dip it in there. You can see the water just comes off it. I'll leave it in there as well. I'll put the other one in as well. You can just, they're just absolutely, completely waterproof. And then if we go to the tear-proof of them, I'm just gonna dry that off for the purposes of getting water all over the table. And if we try and tear it, I mean, I'll send you one in the post and you might be stronger than me, but all it's ever gonna do is slightly crease it. Um, so yeah, totally tear-proof and uh, waterproof. Um, so how thick are they? I get that, asked that as well, just dry my hands here. Um, well, they're more like a, I'd say a 300 gram paper type of thickness really. Um, you can see there, you can hear this kind of vinyl nature of it really uh, but yeah in and around sort of 300 gram if that means nothing to you um, then uh, drop us an email and we'll uh, send one out in the post for you so who orders them and what can they be used for well typical customers are for example heavy industry i.e attached to parts of machinery and metal items getting moved around a factory garden centers have versions attached to stoneware in the outside parts of the locations and in the travel industry um, they can get used for luggage tags as well if we go back to these particular ones, which were live samples that we have on the shelf. So this one was, uh, for example, uh, I think this is a boiler manufacturer or a valve manufacturer. Um, this one was a campsite in Wales and that gets attached to tents when people book in. And this one, again, heavy industry in an engineering company. Um, just points to note really for them, um, they're only as good as the attachments. So if you put string on them, the string is going to be probably weaker than the actual tag itself. You've seen before in the um, earlier in the video uh, how waterproof and tearproof they are. So if you put um, a piece of string that's not too strong on there, that's going to be the weak link really. Um, we provide a full range of string options, but if these are to used in heavy industry, what I would do is put cable ties on them, which is what the majority of our customers do. Um, they can be written with a biro, although for best results I'd use something more permanent like a, a Sharpie or a permanent marker. If in the meantime you need any help or advice with your swing tech requirements, um, or even just a sample pack, you can either email, call or use live help and either myself or one of the team will be able to assist you. Thanks for watching.